Hello and welcome back to another episode on how we can start the day right. This week, I'll be sharing with you a new product range from John Frieda. So let's go get that glossy shine. A lot of the John Frieda products are centered around colored hair and this range is no different. With me today, I have the shampoo, the conditioner and the 3 in 1 shine spray. This shampoo and conditioner instantly amplifies glossy shine to bring out the best in your color. As you can see, I obviously love dyeing my hair quite a fair bit so I'm really excited to try this. And this innovative formula is lightweight rose hip oil and shine enhancing complex work together to gently cleanse and illuminate their radiance from the hair from within without weighing it down. Rose oil is commonly known to remove darling residue, bringing you that extra sheen. This shampoo and conditioner is safe for coloured and natural hair types as it's vegan, cruelty-free and also free from parabens, silicones and sulfates. Not to mention, these bottles are also biodegradable. That is superb! And I'm going to show you how soft your hair can feel with just a small part of my hair. So I'm going to try to wash my hair right now. Oh wow, look at that, it's leathering up so easily already and I like that it's very soft on my hair. It doesn't feel like it's going to make my hair a lot more detangled, so that's really, really nice. Ta-da! And I like that it wasn't very um, rough. It actually makes my hair feel smooth even though I've bleached my hair like a lot of times. I just need to blow dry it now. I also have here with me the Vibrant Shine 3-in-1 Shine Spray. This innovative John Frieda Vibrant Shine 3-in-1 Shine Spray contains argan oil that helps to detangle your hair and provides heat protection up to 200 degrees Celsius. Overall, the smell for this range is great and there was a hint of rose which is not overbearing or overpowering which I really, really like. I hope you're as excited as I am with this product at Guardian. Looking forward to seeing you at the next Guardian Recommends next week. Bye-bye!